I simply flat out don't like the kid. I have no respect for him whatsoever. I personally despise the guy as well. That's why it's going to be such a great fight. Because we do not like each other. This isn't going to be a glorified sparring match. It's going to be two men battling it out, wanting to destroy each other and put each other in the hospital. He called me out and then chickened out and then called me out again and then chickened out again. If you're going to say you're going to do something, you do it. If you're not going to do it, don't chicken out and then keep running your mouth. Show up and let's do this. Well, what actually happened is I broke my hand in my last fight. So well before a contract was signed, I had to contact Scott and tell him, look, I'm not going to be able to do this fight. It doesn't matter what Jerome thinks about how long I've been dodging. The fact is, I'm going to be in the cage with him, and he has to deal with me. He's going to get ripped up, and that's going to be the end of him. It's going to be the end of Hatch. It's going to be the last fight he's going to have for a while. I'm going to go in there, and I'm going to give it everything i got. I'm going to put him away in the first round. I mean, I'm going to push the pace, just like I always do, but I'm coming a lot harder, stronger, and faster this time. The reason he wants to end the fight early is because he doesn't have the cardio to go. So he needs to end the fight early because if he doesn't, he's going to get the crap kicked out of him. He'll see. You know, you don't think I got the cardio. I know that I can step in the cage and put his ass away quicker than he will ever even know. He won't even know what hit him. But you and I will. We got old Jack here and Sledge, the old Hammer Twins, okay? And they're coming right for Josh, and he is not going to back out anymore. Just words from a man that's scared, that's worried about what's going to happen. Drone hats don't get afraid. Okay, I don't care who it is, I don't get afraid. On a personal note to Jerome Hatch's fans, because I know he'd be watching this, because there's a lot. You better be worried. I have legit knockout power. This guy keeps his chin out. This guy swings through the fences. Everything this guy does puts him in trouble with me. So you better be apprehensive, because this night is not going to go how you want it to. Watch out, fans. I was talking to you guys. I've been focused on him for seven months of my life. And when I get in that cage, it's not just to knock him out quickly, it's to bruise and batter him and make him wish he wasn't there. And even if he gives me the tap, I won't take it. Because I plan on pounding his face until he gets an overnight stay in the hospital. I really don't. I really don't like the kid at all. I really don't. I, I don't understand it. I don't know.